topic for today is passive and active electronic components. An active component is an electronic component which supplies energy to a circuit and have the ability to electrically control electron flow and capable of delivering the energy independently for an infinite period of time and to supply an average power to some external devices. A current source is also considered an active component. The current supplied to a circuit by an ideal current source is an independent circuit voltage. All electronic circuits must contain at least one active component. Common examples of active components include voltage source, current sources, generators, alternators, all different types of transistors such as FET or field effect transistors, bipolar junction transistors, MOSFET and GFET or junction field effect transistors, diodes like silicon, zener, photodiodes, and LED or light emitting diode. Passive components are electronic components which consume energy in the form of voltage from the source but does not produce or supply energy and cannot control the flow of electron or electric current through a circuit, but they limit the flow of electrons or electric current. Passive devices are the main components used in electronics such as resistors, inductors, and capacitors, and transformers, which together are required to build any electrical or electronic circuits. One of the components of active components are the battery. Battery is a device consisting of electromechanical cell used for powering electrical devices such as mobile phones, remote controls, and car battery. A transistor is a semiconductor device used to amplify or switch electronic signals and electrical power. A diode is a two-terminal electronic component that conducts current primarily in one direction. Seven segment display is a form electronic display for displaying decimal numerals that is an alternative for more complex dot matrix. Photodiode is a semiconductor device that converts light into electrical current. An operational amplifier or op-amps is a voltage amplifying device that designed to be used with an external feedback components such as resistor and capacitors between its output and input terminals. A silicon controlled rectifier is a 3 layer or 4 layer semiconductor current controlling device it is mainly used in the devices for controlling high power. Photodiode is one type of light detector used to convert light into current or voltage based on mode of operation. IC or integrated circuit is a small electronic device consisting of transistor, resistor, and capacitor. Now, let's proceed to our passive components. Passive components are electronic components which consume energy in the form of voltage from the source, but does not produce or supply energy and cannot control the flow of electron or electric current through a circuit, but they limit the flow of electrons or electric current. Passive devices are the main components used in electronics such as resistors, inductors, capacitors, and transformers which together are required to build any electrical or electronic circuit. In these examples, we have resistor. Resistor is a passive two-terminal component that limit the flow of current. Resistor used to step up or lower the voltage at different points in a circuit. Capacitor is a device to store electronic charge for a short period of time that consists of two metallic plates separated by dielectric. An inductor resists chains and the flow of electric current through it. Switch is a device for making and breaking the connections in a circuit. A thermistor is a resistance thermometer or a resistor whose resistance is dependent on temperature. The term is a combination of thermal and resistor. It's made up of metallic oxide. There are two types of thermistor, negative temperature coefficient and positive temperature coefficient. With negative temperature coefficient thermistors, when the temperature increases, resistance decreases. Conversely, when temperature decreases, resistance increases. 
A potentiometer is a three terminal resistor in which resistance is manually varied to control the flow of electric current. A transformer is a passive electrical device that transfers electrical energy from one electrical circuit to another or multiple circuit. Thank you for watching and see you on the next video. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Have a good one.